Hi everyone, it's great to see you all. I'm Jo Banks-Smith and I'm the Sports Coordinator at Farn School. Your health and wellbeing is super important. It's especially important right now. I have a few fitness challenges that I'm going to share with you over the next short while. Um, I'm really looking forward to sharing these with you and I hope that you'll enjoy them. They're fun, they're easy, you can do them at home, you can do them in your backyard, perhaps in your hallway, in your living room, and um, I'm really looking forward to sharing these ideas with you. Today, I have a five minute workout to show you, and then you can actually do this, uh, repeat this workout, and you can make it into a 10 minute or a 15 minute workout. These exercises are super easy, you won't need any equipment, except for a skipping rope, but if you don't have a skipping rope, that's fine, you can do it without a skipping rope. So the five exercises that I'm going to show you today um, are squats, burpees, we've got our skipping in the middle, we've got lunges and a plank. Before you begin your workout, it's really important to do a bit of a warm up. I suggest you skip, or I suggest also that you do some uh, shuttle runs. You can shuttle run in your hallway, in your backyard, and do that for about five minutes so that you're ready to start and that will also help to get your heart rate up and prevent an injury. Also have your water ready with you, which you'll all have anyway. So we'll start with squats. I'm not going to do squats for one minute, but I'm just going to show you what a squat should look like. You'll squat for one minute. Each exercise will be for one whole minute. Don't rest in between, move straight on to the next exercise. So squats, you'll have both feet facing forwards, about shoulder width apart. You have your hands out in front of you, or like this, and you're going to sit back as if you're in an armchair, or you're sitting down on the chair. So sitting right back, your weight is back on your heels, and your knees are not going over your toes. You can do them at the pace that I'm doing them at, or you might like to do them a little bit faster or a little bit slower. It's really up to you. Just so you can see them from the side back view as well, that's a squat. So keeping your back nice and straight and looking forward. You don't wanna be bending over. So keep going for one minute. Then you'll move straight onto the next uh, exercise, which is a burpee. We all love burpees. So we love them though, because they're really good for you. So burpee, both hands are going down. You'll jump back with two feet, back up, and then jumping back up again like that. If you like, you can give a bit of a clap up the top and celebrate that you've done a burpee. So back. Forward and up. And now we'll move straight into skipping. I've got my rope today. If you don't have a rope, it doesn't matter. You can just hold your hands out as if you're holding on to a skipping rope. It'll do the same thing. Skipping for one whole minute without the rope, it'll look a little bit like that. You wouldn't even know. Lunges are next. So with lunges, You'll have your hands on your hips. You're gonna step forward with alternate legs. We'll step forward out with our right and then with our left. So keeping your chest up, looking straight ahead and dropping your knee to the ground. You don't wanna to touch the ground, just hover slightly above the ground. I'll show you from the side view. So looking straight ahead and lunging. Lunging for one minute. And then to plank, straight onto a plank. Plank's great for your core. I'm going to plank onto my elbows and put my feet straight out behind me, making sure I'm not sticking my bottom up. I'm keeping my core really tight. So you'll plank like this for one minute. You'll be right. You'll do it. So that's our five minute workout. See if you can do it again for 10 minutes and perhaps if you find that a challenge, have a rest, come back to it in a couple of days and you can try and do it for three sets and see how you go. In between each set, have about a 30 second rest. Have some water to keep you hydrated and have a warm down at the end. So do some stretches. You might like to do your shuttle runs again to finish off. So I hope you've enjoyed yourselves. I certainly have. Students, keep looking on the tree and we'll be putting some more fitness challenges there for you. And Farn Community, keep your eye out on Facebook and we'll put any links to any fitness challenges for you there. Thanks everyone.